hi guys today in this video we will learn how to add a icon on the website and here we will use the font awesome icon so let's come to the official website just type font awesome on google and you will get this website fontawesome.com here you can see the current version is 5.15.3 so let's click on this start for free let's click here and here it is asking for your email id enter your email id and click on this button send kit code and the second method is use this download option and download the file on your pc so let's go with the first option which is adding your email id and creating one account here so enter your email id and click on this button so it will send you a account completion link you will receive one email from font awesome like this click on this button and enter your new password and set up your account once you will complete your account creation you will come to this page here you can see there is a script this is the font awesome kit so you have to copy this one just copy this one line of the script and come back to your html file in this html file add this script within the head tag you can see here is the head tag so i will add this script here like this now i can add any icon on the web page so let's come back to the font awesome website now click on this icons and in this search box we can search for any icon so let me search for the times you can see there is so many icons here this icon and the second one is pro we can't use this one in the free account other icons are pro let me use the first one which is free i will click here and here you can see html code so just copy this one click here to copy and come back to your html file place this code anywhere on the html file where you want to display this icon so i have added it here now i will refresh my website and you can see this icon on this web page let me zoom this web page so that you can see here's the icon so let's add one more icon i will come back to the search box and here i will search for another icon let's write facebook i will open this one then click here to copy this html code and come to the html file add it here so i have added one more icon refresh the website again and you can see another icon also so this is the process to add a font or some icon with the online link let me tell you one more thing if you want to design these icons so you have to use the class name so you can see the class name is fas and here the class name is fab you can use these class also fa dash times fa dash facebook dash f you can use these class also so i will go with this simple one i will just copy this class name fas come to the css file and here i will write like this i will add the color red and if i refresh the website you can see this cross icon in the red color and there is no effect on the fb icon because you can see the class name is different here for this facebook the class name is fab so let's copy this one and i will add it here and here also i will add color like this now you can see the facebook icon in the blue color so this is how you can apply the css properties on the icons now i will tell you the another method to add the icons on your website so let's come back to the font of some official website let's click on this button start scroll down and click on this download i will click here here you can see this button download font or some free for the web let's click here and it will download a zip file so we got this file here 
let's unzip this file in this folder you can see we have lots of files let me zoom it so that you can see clearly from this file we need this CSS file and uh, this web fonts these two things we need CSS and this web fonts this one and this one so just copy these two folder copy and come back to your project folder so this is my project folder where I have only HTML and CSS file I will add this folder here CSS and web fonts so in this web fonts you can see these are the file so don't do anything with this one let's come back to the CSS and here you can see we have lots of files so basically we need this one only all.css we can delete other files and we need this all.css that's it so let's come back to the code again and let me remove this online link I will remove this online font awesome link and here I will connect the local file I'll write link rel styles it because it is a CSS file href in the href write the path of the CSS file so it is in the CSS folder so write CSS slash and the file name which is all.css like this so this is all we have to do save these changes and if I refresh the website again you can see still we can see the icon so this was the simple method to add the font or some icons on your website I hope this video will be helpful for you if you have any question you can ask me in the comment section and please like and share this video and also subscribe my channel easy tutorials to watch more videos like this one thank you so much for watching this video